thought I like deleted something that was important. Oops, a daisy. Hmm. I don't. I just cannot get this character to come out the way I want it to. I don't understand how to do character design. Maybe, maybe that's it. Maybe my whole problem is I actually am a fraud. <laughs> Your whole empire. Crumbling. Fraud. still want so yeah. I, I want like a mix of like organic shapes with like mechanical shapes mm -hmm. I don't know I don't know I just don't know Nej, jag ska också ha det. Det funkar inte. Um, splitten funkar inte heller. Det är egentligen inte så skriver jag till det. Jag behöver typ en USB som går från USB till HDMI. Nej, det var det inte, men jag kände så kallt att jag inte tänkte på det först. Jag sa det åt dig. Stort i dina. Du är speciellt, jag har det ändå. Lyssnar du bara inte? Rätt. Hä? Jag vill ha en smacka. Vad är det? Gör du det då? Nej, jag vill inte göra det. Mm. So, question. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, who? To, uh, whoever wants to answer. Um, it's more of a general question. Um, so for adoptables, right? Like, what advantage do you see adoptables having? And if you, if you do more like quick you custom. Art anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I've never gotten into that adoptable thing, so I can't answer that. After all my help I gave you, you betray me. Just kidding, I'm just kidding. I mean, I think adoptables are most popular in furry um, community, right? That's at least where I've seen them the most. So, okay, so here's here's the next big question, right? All right, so let's let's just imagine for a second that I I draw a character, right? Mm -hmm. And I don't really like I don't need this character for anything. It's just like a personal thing or whatever that I draw. I then say, okay, I want to make some money off of this character that I've already drawn. Babe. So the process of Babe. like that's what is it? <laughs> <laughs> it's just my fiance. Oh hi. We <laughs> uh, <laughs> continue. Um, but yeah, so like I'm like okay, so I'm gonna put this up as an adoptable, right? Because that's kind of the that's kind of the thought process on adoptables is they um they're already created characters in most cases with that you can like maybe change but also not usually um and uh so i i put this up as an adoptable now does the person who adopts it right like what what are they actually like what is the transaction for do they get to then use that art without like crediting or what what are they what are they getting out of that adoptable if anyone knows Do they? Sorry if I'm like cutting people off. Is someone answering? Else? I don't know. I, I I don't think. Yeah, I'm like I'm like okay. So so like, because like the hypothetical I'm thinking of is like okay. So what if what what's stopping me right from reselling mm -hmm. the same adoptable right? Like it, how are you? How how is it an adoptable or 
like are you really just buying like what's a did like a digital print of something like the most kind of the most ridiculous concept because nfts <laughs> yeah like because and like is it <laughs> i'm i'm confused because i'm like I, what's stopping me from from reselling this if i if i want to and and is that even frowned upon like is it something like okay if this person buys my character that i drew are they are they the only ones who can use it or is it something that like it's okay if i resell it again to somebody else who wants to use that character like does that matter is that like a am i a bad person for for like not I think knowing it would this be, I, I think it would be frowned upon if you like bought a uh, adoptable and then resell it because i think just in general buy an adoptable is because the artist has such a like creative character design so they like want to buy that design that's what i think Right, but then does that mean that now the artist can't use that design for anything else is the next question. And and why why would they do that? Why would they want to do that method of of uh of of doing that versus um versus just doing a commission where someone tells you, you know, I want this for myself, I'm gonna pay you money to do this, et cetera, oh right? God, like sorry i didn't hear the last part oh just just that like you know uh like why wouldn't why wouldn't you just com commission somebody to to do something because now you for sure have those rights right like i i'm not allowed mm -hmm. to then go and take that like and put that somewhere else and say i'm going to resell this person's commission that i made for them like i can't do that i am not allowed to because i made that for this person like sure. I, Whereas if I just draw a random character and then say, I, uh, you know, who wants to buy it? Like, can I just keep selling the same random character? Like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Like, I, because like technically no one commissioned me to do it, so like it's my art all the way. It's it's I'm the one who has the rights to do something with it. If I'm selling it. If I'm selling the the rights to the art, I, so I'm actually I maybe I'm maybe I'm too business minded on this whole thing, right? Because if I'm selling the rights to an art piece that I that I'm doing, right? So now I can no longer like you know do anything with that. I'm charging a heck of a lot more than like what a lot of adoptable artists charge, which is like twenty bucks, right? Like that's the highest amount that you'll see an adoptable be is like twenty bucks, because um, most cases it'll be like five dollar adoptables, and I'm like why how what <laughs> um so like because like what you're like what that basically says to me is that like this person sat down for however long it takes them to draw a character and they drew that character and now they're being compensated practically nothing for that they're selling they're selling that character for pretty much nothing um, what's that i'm gonna go the queen died what? Wow. The queen died? Queen Elizabeth. Died at 96. Wow. Dropping her butt. Long live the queen, I guess. England. Who's, uh. Well, no, so so that's what you say when you're. Yeah. Uh, so so who's the who's the new um monarch then? Is Charles the. Because it was going to be. But they got disowned or something like that, didn't they? I don't know. It wasn't only that. No, they were like. That's right. That's right. I'm gonna go out. Probably check in later. Okay. See ya. Breaking news, everyone! The queen is dead. <laughs> Britain's matriarch. I mean, it's not like this is a surprise. It's also somewhat, I, I hesitate to say less tragic. Like, obviously, death is always a tragedy, but, like, you know, she's 99. I know, right? Like, who, who could have guessed she would have died? <laughs> so, she's 96. Damn.
Fuck if I know. I don't know how to <laughs> succession. Okay, Charles. Charles. But he is like, he's also like 80 though. Yeah, he's the perv. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Welcome back to King Hood. <laughs> yeah, no, they have no, they, they just have money. <laughs> so. Yeah. Never thought that would ever happen. Just didn't think it would happen. I thought I, I, thought I would die before. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I was uh, pretty convinced. Hey, welcome, Lynx. Did you see? Uh, did you see the queen died? No, but I actually I, I heard of it. Yeah. Because I saw someone say, "Rip the queen." Rip the queen. Oh. He died. Yeah. Sad day, but like also, I just basically I just thought that it would never happen in my lifetime. So <laughs> I thought she would outlive me. We gotta celebrate. Oh, we gotta uncelebrate. She left my crown. I've been wanting to watch it for like a couple of years, and I just haven't. It's kind of a good time too. All right, so. Kind of what I want is I want her legs to have this ability to like split apart into like terrifying spider legs. So you're making her uh, spider furry? Uh, <gasps> is that a thing? I can draw spider furries all day. Oh hey. <laughs> You say something to me? Furry, like yeah, but I didn't even think that like like furries would be interested in that. But now I'm thinking about it, and they totally would be. So. So you're gonna be a spider furry person now? I could totally do it. That's wonderful. Then you're a spider furry. I mean, all right. No, I I can't say that I don't have a super soft spot for Ragnara, um, but. Smoochy smooch. Give me those, give me those furry, uh, oh shoot, what are they called? The, the, the hands they have in the front of their mouth, what are they called? Who knows that? Nobody knows Yeah, no, I do, I do know it. Shut up, you don't know. <laughs> yeah, because, because I'm normal and I don't see Oh, oh, wow, oh, just throw the normal card out there, why don't you? <laughs> okay, you're not wrong, but like, <laughs> I'm still mildly insulted. I'm still insulted by the person that you out there. Why? Okay. So I made a sleeve of a sleeve and another sleeve. That's wonderful, right? Yeah. Let me actually save my drawing now. Um, because I've been drawing this for a long time. <laughs> yeah, I know it's it's super delayed. Hang on. Yeah, the delay is super bad. Wait, My equipment is kind of ass for streaming. How do you fix your delay? Do you know how to do that? Uh, so what it is is it's my um essentially my 
like processor isn't strong enough to like handle streaming as well as drawing so it's like trying to split the split the difference and neither thing works very well essentially <laughs> so Oh yeah, no, I I know how to do it. I just you know don't want to. So. Task manager is important because uh, important because uh, I can I see stuff. Can you? Yeah. That doesn't sound right. Just kidding. <laughs> That's tempting. I'm getting a phone call. I shall be back. Oh. Hey Crow. Hey, what's up? Did you hear the the queen died? Yeah. Yeah. Hashtag rip buzz. Oh, hashtag smoking that queen pack. Damn. <laughs> Everybody, uh, the uh, what's my call it? The wait, what the fuck? Bro, I have a friend named Lorenzo, and that just ripped me the fuck out. Anyway, uh, so the Valorant community is just going wild, bro. Like, people be saying, uh, the queen should have had a sage in her palace. Uh, where, where, what was it? Uh, what were they saying? Excuse me? Yeah, Queen Lizzie saw her thieves on the first map and dipped. <laughs> Did you go next at Royal Family? Um, I actually have to do a, like a portfolio about King Vent, and I'm also gonna do something about um, Queen Elizabeth. 
it's funny. Sounds like fun. Yeah. Red. Yeah. yeah. Ripperoni. No, it's, it's very cool. Rip Bozo is trending on Twitter right now. Rip Bozo. Yeah. It's a it's a meme. I don't know this meme. Maybe I don't want to know this meme. So people are figuring out that the queen is dead with the Valorant tournament chat. So I'm like, I don't understand. What is this queen stuff about? <laughs> Who's the queen? <laughs> what queen? <laughs> people are saying. Uh, people are saying stuff like. Uh, so do we really just switch up the lyrics and just say God save the king now? Yeah, that's that's pretty much that's literally it, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> like that's literally what they do. Yeah, and people are people are saying fanatics sacrificed the queen to to get out of groups. Oh my god. How did she die? I had old age, she was fucking ninety six or yeah. something. Ninety three? Ninety six? Ninety six. Ninety six. I mean, I'd not your your body parts don't keep working forever. <laughs> it's unfortunate, but really? true. Wait, wait, really? I mean, I... I thought this was, the... was, was only a thing in video <laughs> games. Then no, that was real. Give me like what I sent you. Laying down, fuck. Wait, wait you can die. Too. You can you can die in real life. Yeah, you can die in the if you die in the game, you die in real life. No, it's that. Oh really? Oh no. Yeah, if you die in real life, you die in the game. <laughs> wait, what? No, no, I don't, look at I don't the picture. Wanna die. I'm looking right now. It's loading. No, no, you mean look, 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 like look, like open the tweet and look at the picture. Too scared. Too scared to click on links from strangers. Okay, okay, okay. I, I see it. I see it. <laughs> <laughs> The case of one, what? <laughs> look, look at the picture. He's died, Buckingham Palace, which is just David Kaferian. Victory over the Queen. <laughs> there's, uh, a fucking, there's a fucking rainbow over the fucking palace. That's great. It's a double rainbow all the way. Probably do her voice. Wait, if I if I go full B girl enough, I can probably mimic Lux's voice. That's scary. A little bit, actually. I was like, I should comment on this, but uh, you know. <laughs> okay, you know, usually like in the morning, my voice is pretty decent, you know, and then as as the day progresses on, it gets lighter and lighter, and then once I start playing video games, I turn into a twelve-year-old screaming child. Ooh, the twelve-year-old screeching children. They're called the screeching eels, and they always get louder when they're about to feed. <laughs> Shall I just cosplay Lux for an entire day and see how she would feel? Like, I'll when when new people join the chat, I'll just I'll do my girl voice. That way, they think it's my actual voice. So Bro. I don't know how much strain I'll put on my voice. <laughs> Uh, I'm looking at the, uh, there's a Valorant forum, and the dude goes, not dead, bro, fake news, she just had a major health alert, but news says she's safe. <laughs> and dude just replies, check again, and he just replies, no! <laughs> Poor man, fuck my life. Are they not allowed, um, knife, knife skin? What do you mean? has a normal knife like a plebeian. Who are you looking at? Loster. Loster has a normal knife. I don't know, he's probably doing it for a meme. Cause uh, oh my god, Durka. I'm gonna fucking cry. Oh, oh this I missed the right click. Yeah, no, so so the tournament accounts that they're on? 
how oh. all the skins unlock. Yeah, I I I have my I don't know if I'm still active or not, but I have an account. I have a tournament realm account. They just you just get all the skins. Yep, so. dating. <laughs> oh no, I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't worry, it'll be hot spiders. Hot spiders? Sexy spiders? Are they going to go B now, I'm guessing, because of, like, you know, the fact that... Maybe they do. Maybe you are wrong, huh? Oh, Boaster. Oh no. Oh, Vizier. Oh no. Oh my gosh. What is going on? Oh, it's Derek left in a 1v2. Thoughts? 1v3. Oh yeah, 1v3. You guys playing uh, League still? Or Valorant. We're watching. <laughs> You're watching the Queen. Yes, we're watching the Queen. VCT Valorant Champions Tour. Gosh, oh, I oh, saw I'm that. I'm shocked you don't know. Ty, what's wrong with you? Fucking 32, and he can't. He still doesn't fucking know shit. Dude. Like facts, though. Fnatic taking a timeout, 7 4. I'm gonna throw into a ball. Do it. Please. You're probably big enough to ball, ball, uh, bowl with, you know? So. A bowl? Ball? I felt like. Yeah. A bowling ball. I felt like that's like a fat joke, but also I'm just not sure. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a small joke. Oh, oh, okay. I totally missed. I missed the fat, the the small part of it, because uh, like usually people are like, "Yeah, bowling ball, you're huge, jeez." <laughs> I mean, I called her a garden gnome earlier, so. I'm not a. It's okay, Yumi. We all have our place. Yours just happens to be the front yard. I was taller than me, I'm pretty sure. I'm six. I'm six foot. Like six. I'm six foot. Okay. Same same height as you. We're not even tall. It's not even tall. Listen. Also, also, I was talking with somebody earlier who said they were really insecure about their height, but they're like five nine. I was like, Are you okay, sir? <laughs> like, five nine is not that short. Like, I I think I might be insecure about my height if I was like four nine. I mean, I, looking at you, looking at you, Yumi. <laughs> Glares directly. <laughs> Your height's short and you should feel short. You know what? I hope you guys all shrink so I can use you as a shoulder rest. I'm putting a curse on you, Uga Booga. The curse of the shortness. The shortening. <laughs> the curse of the shortening. <laughs> the next Twitter sensation is the shortening. It's where everyone becomes short. Oh, 
<laughs> Bro, New King just dropped. Shut the fuck up. New King just dropped. That's that's not a good thing. Drop dead, hopefully. Yeah, he's uh he's not much younger than the than the queen was. He's like eighty something, I think, or seventy something. That's what I said. I'm like five. What was it? Yeah, five nine. He's like, he's like, oh, I'm so Charles insecure. Charles is now the king, king of the United Kingdom. Points. What? God damn, she's hot. He's, no, he's the king now. I'm looking at the woman. She's hot. He's seventy three. Who are you talking to? Crow. Seventy three. Yeah, that's what I said. I thought you said. Probably feels like it. My back feels like it's 73. <laughs> he was just regular insecure. <laughs> he wasn't insecure about his height, he was just regular insecure. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> I think I caught the COVID from my sister. She better not have COVID. Oh, that's hot. Dude, oh, I thanks. Don't, I don't even go outside. I'm not going outside and catching COVID inside my own damn upkeep. Uh, this needs to be rounded or. Dee's lost 13 and 0 on a scent before? Yeah. Well, that was a different team, but yeah. Nice. I mean, that was like almost a completely different team. No, I think that they're trolling us. I don't think that the new king died no. too. Oh, wait, what? what? My, I'm my, my Twitch, my Twitch chat, my uh, my viewer is uh is talking to me. I'd be I'd be shocked if he died too. But honestly, though, that'd be pretty impressive. I, would, no, I, I wouldn't be. I mean, well, I mean, based on the fact that she lived to be ninety six and he's from the same family, like. I don't know. I'd say he's got at least like a, a, at least ten years on him. Their monitors so tiny. Their monitors aren't tiny. They're like twenty four inches. Who are you talking about? God, if you think <laughs> the, she's talking about VCT, and also if you think twenty four inches is small, then I, I have no, I have no. <laughs> yeah, rut row. She, she should have gotten. That's funny. But my, I think my monitor's 36 and my side monitor's 27. I, I just have two 24 inch monitors. Ooh, overcompensating. It's okay. Yeah. You put Never it together, small. it's in the 40s. For a short time, I just had, I just had on my, on my Tinder bio crow. <laughs> I'm just looking for a girl to tell me that, that, okay, you're, I'm here. Your mic is uh, echoing, Yumi. I didn't do anything. Ugh. Your mic just started echoing. Me. Oh, Weirdly. Okay. okay. Alright. It's all over for me. <laughs> no, I put on my Tinder bio for a while. I was like looking for a girl to tell me that five inches is big. It is. Are you trying to brag over here? What are you? What are you? What are you? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Keeping it. Keeping it. SFW, man. They're children in this call. <laughs> you think? Well, considering there's two people who are completely deafened, and there's one person who's streaming, and they have the 18 plus tag, I'm not worried. Unless, unless Crow is underage, and I just don't know. <laughs> Twelve year old twelve year old boomer over here. <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> Haven't the best of us. Oh, so close. Yeah, I think a hundred of these might be checked out here. They are. They are old as dirt. They're older than dirt. Might be older than a lot of dirt. A lot of English dirt even.
Don't die on us, you me. Put me, put me as your uh, insurance uh, beneficiary. <laughs> insurance uh, beneficiary. Yeah. Uh, what I need the money. Yeah, that's cute oh, that you think that there's like. <laughs> yeah, we're we're artists over here. You wanna you wanna commission some? That's where we get our money, you know. <laughs> You're funny to think we get commissions. <laughs> He's cute, isn't he? I He's mean, hilarious. I mean, I just want money. I don't give a fuck. I don't have. Damn. All right. Talk to you guys later. See ya. Wait. Wait. <laughs> wait a minute. Wow, 300,000, dang, nice. Bro, not the I'm just kidding. <laughs> bro, bro, one of the guys I follow tweets out, the Queen's funeral will be sponsored by Shadow Legends. <laughs> oh, no. You can't get away from it. Raid Shadow Legends. Raid. What if what if I did art for Raid Sat Shadow Legends? That'd be actually pretty cool. Although I still think that they have some of the like I get paid a lot of money. You probably get paid a lot of money, but like I still feel like they have like honestly a scam for everything, including their art. <laughs> I'm just like not convinced. Uh... What is Raid like a uh, <gasps> to Jared? Alright, so the concept yeah, here is like. Valorant, but I know for a fact it's gonna, I'm, my team's gonna turn into 100 bees and just absolutely run it down. <laughs> yeah, probably. I mean, you're flat, so. Uh, they say it gets better the higher you climb. Wait, 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 who said that? <laughs> yeah, no one yeah, said yeah. that. <laughs> See, when I, when Whoever I said that. that somebody who is lower ranked than you and ha is huffing copium. <laughs> the thing is, a lot of my, um, usually in every friend group that I'm in, I'm usually the highest ranked. And so most of my friends are just like, oh, my team is an absolute fucking garbage or, um, like, I would, I should be in a higher elo or the higher Sure, elo you should, sure, you should. Will be. And I'm just like, dude, I, I've been in, I, I've been in play, like, in games where I've gone against dying two people in Valorant, and for some reason, they still end up getting 25 deaths in a game. Like, it doesn't get better the higher you go up. Like, it I never does. I who is Diamond. What, like Diamond 3 playing Wraith and he went 2 and 22 in a game and I'm just like you're the highest elo gear and you're getting shit on by plat players probably drunk as fuck honestly uh, it gets better but it doesn't no no That's I play better when I'm drunk oh my god I have I have some friends who play so well when they're drunk but when they're not they play like absolute dog shit I have a friend who, who and he plays uh whatchamacallit, he only plays when he's absolutely fucking shit faced and high at the same time. Are we talking about Wesley here? <laughs> no. i I said immortal too. Oh yeah yeah. Valorant. Or I have a I have uh, two old friends. Um one would get high and one would get drunk. And they'd play bot lane together in league. <laughs> oh my they, god. I actually, I play, I play high when I play league. Oh my god, no, no. Not in drunk. This is my, this is my experience in bronze. This is why I'm still <laughs> down there in bronze. I only, I only play bot, so it's like always chill. Oh hey, that's you, Lupa, isn't it? Yeah. Hey, how's it going? Missed you. Going good. Yeah. Tired of seeing people go zero and <laughs> yeah, that's like I'm like terrified to play ranked, <laughs> like hey, actually scary. I mean, that was basically your game in Valorant earlier, wasn't it? Too that's crazy. Oh my fucking god, the chamber went zero and fucking eleven half the round, half the game. 
How do you go zero and oh eleven? Oh my gosh. Like untouchable. Damn. I mean, I mean, I mean that's literally. Like that's you don't even like approach that on. sucker. You're just like not. You're, you're on the other side of the map. <laughs> that's that's like toxic gameplay right there. Like oh boy. <laughs> What character was he playing? Chamber. Yeah. Chamber? He was, yeah, he was Tom playing Bray, Chamber. Okay. Oh. I fucking love playing Bard, though. I mean, can I boast about, like, my bot score? <laughs> Actually, change my mind. Can you, I even want... boast? can you even boast about that? No, I'm <laughs> sorry. <Yeah. laughs> like, literally, no. I mean, like, but one time, I got 30 kills. <laughs> God. I think that's pretty impressive. Do we? Do we tell her, guys? <laughs> no, let me live in my dream. Okay, all right. Live your dream. You're fine. <laughs> I believe in you. You know, at this point, I'm I'm convinced that bots do better than my actual teammates in the game. Oh my hey. god, <laughs> Fang is just better. Who plays a bard though? Anyone? Hey, I've Fucking, that shit's fun. That's that's what I keep hearing, but like I played Bard one time, so I'm like, this is kind of fun. <laughs> a new awakening is happening. <laughs> I, I play Katarina, and every time I have a Bard player, uh, right, for some reason they're a they're they're a Masters player who's stuck in Plat. Like uh, for the season before, they were in Masters and rank, but now they're stuck in Plat, and they're all trash. Every Bard player. <laughs> I'm unfamiliar with trash talk. Is it trash because they're so good, or is it trash because like they don't let you play the game? Oh, uh, yep, yep. Uh, guilty, guilty. <laughs> I've never done that before. Wait, wait, I use, I use my, I use the all in different ways, not just. I that's mean, what all the, the bard players. That's know. what all the bard players say. <laughs> Nailed it. Oh no, worse than Yasu. That is the ultimate insult you can give so. someone. In <laughs> That's the ultimate league insult. Oh, you're worse than a Yasuo player. <laughs> Yasuo one trick. <laughs> <laughs> hey, okay. At least, at least my dirty tricks are only against bots. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh man. Another reason why I play bots, just in case. <laughs> I'm having a life crisis over bard players now. Look what you okay, I, I'm. What, a, what other uh, characters do you play, champions? Uh, well, technically I'm a cat one trick, but um, according to poor professor, I'm a thresh one trick currently. So I mean, <clears throat> I'm mo like the reason why I mentioned Bard was like, oh my gosh, a new awakening because I'm usually like uh, a Zaya uh, one trick. <laughs> I fucking love playing Zaya. I think I have 1.5 mil on my cat on my main account, and then if you put all of my accounts together, I probably have two mil. I probably don't have that much, but I'm curious now. <laughs> so we are doing this. I think on. The I also have 500k on Morgana. Morgana's pretty fun. Morgana is so fun. She's honestly like she's broken, but in a in like a good way, in like a fun way. Oh uh, yeah, I kind of don't enjoy playing into Morgana. It's not. Oh, I'm sorry. You wanted to play the game. <laughs> good one. <laughs> That's funny. You're cute. <laughs> 
absolutely no one can power dive in one point guard. I'm, 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 I'm the best hooker and 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 peeler and 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 hooker and a literal hooker and. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you me over here. Oh no. Just back on this work yeah. <laughs> like a loop. <laughs> Just keep saying hooker. My 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 Google algorithm is like, hmm. I see you've been into hookers recently. Yeah. <laughs> my Google algorithm is all like jacked up. Like, yeah. <laughs> I guess it's all, this is my life now. Okay. Uh, load. Fuck. Google just 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 loves listening into my conversations and stuff. I think or or just looking at what I'm doing in games. I had um Okay, where do I get that report? I think I got banned off of Arc before. And um my entire ad for YouTube were new Arc accounts. No, I'm training them next month, but I'm preparing so that way I'm not And then let's see. When the whole the whole um what's the I also don't see like are we the squid thing the squid Nintendo girl mm. Oh the like the Splatoon? Yeah. Oh yeah, Juju's. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Away from them. They won't leave me alone. Hey, it's a good game. What you yeah. want? What you want? I had a friend who was obsessed with that game. I kind of liked it, but yeah. <laughs> Today, I'm going to work on Twitch stuff. Woo! Join me. Join me, brother. Twitch yes. Twitch stream, brothers. <laughs> hey, if... I would love to have a Twitch friend. <laughs> Hell yeah. Honestly, so seriously, though, like, I really do need... Go out, go out like, into the fray together. <laughs> yes, I really do need it because, um... Because actually, I... It's it's so harrowing to try to like do a Twitch stream. Um, can I? Oh yes! Just turn that off and no, it's still going. That really should. Can I? Why is that? Why is that a thing? For real though, Snorkel, Ko, Ko. Yeah. I think I'm gonna start with emotes like, because those are easy. Maybe I can indie see it. Like if if you really truly think about it. Okay. So we're not Sorry, it's time to play on my silver account because I don't feel like. Wait, when did that happen? Because I'm gonna cry. Now. <laughs> This is what I do when I can't play on my own ELO. I just go on to another one. How to draw TVs. <laughs> Wait, so <laughs> uh, does anyone else here use Clip Studio? Uh, well, you know I do. Okay, so I have the I have the symmetry mode turned on, right? So I have a I have a what is this a what is this called? So what does that mean for? Well, no, I guess it means a god being. can't think of what it's called but it's yeah but basically basically i can i can draw and it it flips the symmetry right so i can draw both sides of the of the line okay so how do i turn that on and off like i want to stop drawing sym sym symmetrically so go to the ruler the ruler icon on the layer uh, left click it or right click it to bring up the menu you mean did you want to watch me play Oh, you, yeah, you also have like a scroll down tab thing up, up top, so go hey. further up, yeah, so it looks like you can't do it the way that I normally do it, but it looks like you have a scroll down thing next to the lock layer, and like underneath the opacity, um, directly underneath the opacity, there should be like a little, this, this thing here? That should give you, yeah. You know that one? Have you looked okay, into wait. that one? Oh, oh, it's working. Okay, I see what you're saying. Okay, so now I can hit show when I'm editing target. Okay, all right. Turns it on and off. Was, that's it, not, was that's... it showing a menu? Because yeah, it shows it shows a menu. It shows a menu to me, but it's not doing. It's not picking it up on stream. 
um because i have no. it streaming just the clip studio and unfortunately yeah it uh it doesn't know how to do two things at once which is fairly similar to me so no, honestly it's, it's like i mean it's, i it's think valid. it's like more safer that way yeah but as long as you figured it out. Yep. Right. Yes, I did figure it out. I thank you for your assistance on that. Yeah, I, <laughs> like, I don't even unsure. know because like I couldn't see the menus or anything. Right. Like, did, I, did I do anything? <laughs> It'd be easy to draw a chibi, but my brain can't get around it. Oh god, I can't do chibi art to save my life, dude. But I yeah. want to make sure that I'm ready because... You just gotta... Oh, a big blob! I was like halfway through and I'm like, wait a second, we're not doing this anymore, ignore everything that I just did for the past hour here. Like, what? Okay, cool. And then draw trackers for fill. Oh, you want AS? You gotta have AS. <laughs> My client's an ass man. All right, good call, good call. Hey, hey, hey. No, we'll Wait, give her some. We'll give her some booty. Yeah, I'm, he's watching my live stream on Twitch, I, I so I, he's like, it's oh, a little bit of delay, no. um, but. Uh, and I don't know if it's still not checked as red. Here, just sketching on here. Yeah, it's still not checked as red. God damn. What? There, <clears throat> so I just got into Twitch, and like the first like recommended videos are just all ladies. Dem dem ladies. Ladies though. with tubs. <laughs> it's like goddamn. Oh, sure. Okay. Dupe. Turn that off. Going over here. All right, so I think we're gonna go ahead and try this on a new layer. I don't know what to do exactly about her feet. I do kind of just want to leave them like spidery and pointy. What do we feel? How how are we feeling about that? Right, but if I'm not having them running, I feel good about that. Pointy, good. I would like elongate them more, like just like leave what you have now, but like just kind of make the bottom parts kind of dripple down more. Okay, I dig so, it. So it's less like of a square concept and more like a diamond concept. Ooh, shapes. <laughs> it sounds weird when I say that, but no, I agree 100%. Yeah. Um, uh, but I do, that apparently means I have to make this all smaller, which is kind of sad because it's already like getting a little small but <laughs> okay there we go now this is going to be such an epic picture like when it's finished it looks like it yeah okay. i finally i feel i finally feel good about um about this design i think i think this is how we have to do it so what's uh, this concept for? So this is for... Oh, shit. <laughs> to move my line of symmetry. That's always a fun. Um, this concept is for um, a comic book character. I... That will she it's like, she's the she's the like a yeah she is a she's a a extra dimensional <laughs> goddess that is. Hmm. Pretty intense. Um, she's like she's a she's a robot, um, but at the same time, like, uh, kind of like ageless, and she is obviously like a goddess, so it's like hard to. She kind of gives me the vibes from Final Fantasy Seven. Yeah, Genova going on. Yeah, check Genova. out yeah. check out my references. You got you got some Genova over here. <laughs> that was definitely yeah, my. I, 
you nailed it. I nailed it. That. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So Hell definitely yeah. some Genova inspiration happening um, with with her. Well, that means um, it's like actually like getting that message across, yes. like to have that kind of person. Yeah, because she like Genova to me was like one of the most powerful beings that you could you could get in a video game, and so that was like definitely where one of the Pretty places intense, I, yeah. you know. Oh, she's a good one. Yeah, I think that's, um, cause then like what I'm imagining, I'm imagining these legs just kind of like unfold into like a cacophony of mechanical craziness <laughs> that will be mm -hmm. incredibly challenging, but also really fun to draw in a comic setting. <laughs> like, yeah. Think that that's think that that's looking pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and put this on a new layer. We're going to dim this one down a lot. Hit that. Do the symmetrical thingy majig again. How did I do that again? <laughs> I don't, don't remember. Um, How did I do that? Is it a is it a new type of layer? New Oh my god, why can't I figure this out? I swear I'm a professional. <laughs> oh my god, wait, okay. Do chibis have nose? No. Sometimes, depends. Depends on the style. Stylistic choice. I think females don't really go with the nose. It's like a dot if they do have it. <coughs> Oh, it was this button. Symmetrical ruler. Nailed it. What a man, what a man, what a man, what a man, what a motherfucking man. Don't ask me why that song stuck in my head. I'm sorry. So we've got some like, of course I start with the one like asymmetrical spot in the whole composition, that's always fine.
doing like a single point of asymmetry on a composition is a little challenging. Oh god, yeah, no, yeah, uh, this guy's, uh, my client's like, uh, I'm glad I didn't need to tell you she didn't, doesn't have a face in her cosmic form. Yeah, no, faces are for chumps, man. That's like... Faces? That's only for weaklings. <laughs> I ain't got time for a face. Yeah. My whole piece is a face. It's <laughs> shocking, but not in a way that I, like matters to me. Like my first thought is, I'm like, huh? You know, I've been wanting to watch the crown for for the last year. Like maybe that was a good time. <laughs> Anyone here seen the crown? No. Is it like? What is it? It's like a, it's like a, um, so why is that not showing up on it's a British show about the, 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 oh, cra the, the Queen of England or something, something like that. Mm. I've seen okay. like two or two yeah, seasons in I think. But then I dropped it. Wasn't any good? I, it was really good, but then <laughs> I just kind of like did something else and never continued. And just never went back. Okay. Fair enough. Desmond, I'm glad you weren't on here when I was having my whole, like, there's no way a cop like Kennedy would have, like, <laughs> feminine or masculine traits. <laughs> I was doing a whole speech with the, <laughs> with the people on the server. Wait, what were you talking about? The, so, like, we're, we're the, the goddess I'm doing, like, she's, like, mm -hmm. I've given her very feminine traits because, you know, donkey dogs. But, mm -hmm. um, yeah. but, like, like, if you're a, if you're a cosmic, like, semi-deity force in the universe like you're like what is gender what are you know what what why would you have why would you have memories of any kind yeah. like what is this <laughs> like but you know but that's the you know that's the whole fun of it is like and i the reason i i'm like this is actually really cool because we're doing a fantasy story we're not doing uh, a story based on like a realistic sci-fi world this is pure mm -hmm. this is pure like made-up fantasy Great. Yeah, you know, just creation. You know, yeah, and and so that's what makes it fun, and like, you know, it's I I definitely I definitely am looking at us modeling this after like the Final Fantasy series, where like, the things in it don't necessarily make scientific sense, but there's so much like awesomeness in the world that you don't even care. Like, why would you why would you care about the sciencey shit? Like, it's boring. Mm -hmm. It's boring shit. <laughs> Is it going to be kind of along the lines of Blaine, where it doesn't really explain to you anything? Mm. It's just f fucking cogs cosmically, like, fucking with your head? No, we are going kind of the opposite route. So Blaine, I do love oh. me some, I do love me some Blaine. <laughs> it's good stuff. <laughs> uh, but yeah, um, I do love me some Blaine, but the... Uh, the storyline here is definitely we want to kind of explain it, we want people we want people to feel more in in the world right like blame mm -hmm. was like watching a bizarre movie on a st like a study of human it, evolution it looks, it's an experience, <laughs> it's an experience really. yeah. yes like it's yeah. a it's a very bizarre experience that doesn't it's it defies description but um yeah but yeah i i definitely think uh the this story is much more like we want it's it's almost more like kind of a D&D &D campaign in a lot of ways like Ooh. um like you want people to really get involved in and think about the world that they are experiencing um and want them to know more about it and eventually tell them those things because those are the fun things and we're going to do like uh exactly <laughs> Vale four and uh, Final Fantasy uh, Final <laughs> Fantasy ten had uh, had boobs, yeah. so you know, <laughs> um, yeah, no, it's like the like this is this is exactly it. Like we're not we're not too trying to like stick to what a scientific thing would be. We're we're doing it pure magic, and it's amazing, and I love it. I'm I'm super excited to get this story kicked off and and going. Um, I wanna 
I want to have these like characters done. I we I have two more I have to color, but they're both done otherwise, so that's exciting. Um, hmm. I'm looking up the the character that he said, and yeah, it does look like it has some titties. <laughs> got them, got them tatas. Yeah. character concept though Tyler thank you not. yeah i'm really happy finally yeah. fine it took i was like i was struggling i've been struggling for three days on this because i am yeah. a stickler for how i want things to to be um so the fact that i finally found something that is not disgusting to me is good <laughs> yeah it's how it is though it's unfortunate You gotta just keep going until you land on what you like. Yeah, I mean, and that's that's why I'm actually really grateful that I was able to do multiple characters at once. Um, because I have, uh, there was like two of them I got really stuck on. I was like, okay, well this isn't working. The concept is just all wrong. Nothing's quite going right. So, um, so I was just like, all right, let's move on to the next character. I'll do that one up. Um, one of them was like a super easy win because he was a barbarian character. Barbarians. Like mm -hmm. people know what they look like. Big There's muscly. big yeah. muscles and muscles, yeah, and like you know, giant sword. Like these are these are defining traits of a barbarian. If you go outside of that, you can't really call it a barbarian very easily, right? Like you can say the word barbarian mm -hmm. when you're referring to them, but people are gonna be like, really? <laughs> okay, I guess. But like, are you sure? <laughs> like, um... but yeah. I so mean, I was pointing. We were toying around with the idea, so I play D&D, &D, and yeah. we were toying around with the idea of a bardic bar barbarian. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and it would be like a rock and roll. Bard, oh, nice. That would yeah. be super epic. <laughs> Yeah, we were thinking about it, but it's like, oh, what a fucking headache to try to make it work. <laughs> oh, yeah. I... Desmond is commenting, he says, uh, wait till you see the Sage character, which I, let me see if I can pull her out here. Yeah, I'm a fan with how, how she turned out. What's, hold on, I'll just type it to him, what? So do I need both of them, or do I just want one? Okay. Yeah, what's that Edie? Is? That's her name, <laughs> silly buns. Uh -oh. <laughs> no, uh. Oh. <laughs> Is that her name? Yeah, Edie. Yep. Okay. Just so you know. So yeah, there's there's Edie. Days. I think she's pretty nice. I'm still I'm still debating honestly about this like her dress is kind of like transparent like it's supposed to be semi transparent like almost. Uh, like plastic scales is kind of the idea behind it but i'm like i'm like oh. in a comic setting i'm like dear god why why am i doing this to myself <laughs> what am i doing with these characters oh, that yeah that's uh, that's supposed to be that's Edie. um i have to colorize her and then this is uh this is um amy i i think she's pretty fun and then this is the barbarian character uh, sorry it's a bit slow oh you're fine <laughs> Oh, it's faster on Discord. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you're yeah, you'll. That's so. That's the barbarian character. Just finished. Just, I started going in actually today because I needed. I, I today I was feeling kind of down, so I was like, all right, I need I need an easy win. So let me fix up his face so it looks like super epic. And uh, that was what I was doing for like an hour this morning. Looks nice. I like it. I like how how much color you have. Yeah. It's not just one. You have environmental. Yeah. I like her. Oh yeah, I know. I like the blue skin. A Amy is oh, Amy's yeah. gonna be super fun to draw in a comic, I think, because uh, she her concept is like an urban archer thief Ooh. is kind of the the concept behind her. So she's gonna be really fun, um, because she's she's gonna be uh, I want to have her moving a lot. Is is you know the in the con in the comic itself. So. Mhm. Mm Do I have the? Okay, I have it turned on. I was like, do I have it turned on? <laughs> yeah, 
yeah, we're going to. There's going to be some like visual shortcuts. I although I am I am a stickler when it comes to comic stuff. Uh, I I definitely um, even when it's something complex, I will make sure that it looks right regardless of how much time it takes. <laughs> Sometimes to my detriment, admittedly, but. Um, I mean, I I think it's like you know, all for the passion of yeah, creating I, art. I a big part of it. Yeah. How dare you, long live the king? Just kidding. <laughs> My girlfriend's talking about the queen dying. <laughs> We were talking about, like, the Queen of England, like, being so fucking old. <laughs> oh, did you hear she died? She died today. No way. Yeah, for real. No! Like, I thought you were talking about, like, the, the show you were referring to earlier. Oh, no, no. Yeah, no. The Queen actually died today, unfortunately. Bro, no! <laughs> yeah. What a way to find out. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, sorry. I know. Uh, it's no. Live streaming and you find out no. that the queen's dead. I have to tell, I have to tell my partner. Because we were literally talking about, like, wow, she's never going to die the yeah, other day. Yeah, yeah. No, we, I've been, I've been, that's what my girlfriend was just saying. She's like, I'm pretty sure she's going to outlive me. Like, <laughs> uh. I saw that. Right. That sounds like an English thing. <laughs> How very English of you. Right. <laughs> yeah, I... Uh... Mm. Desmond, I'm gonna make you show me the concept that you had before for uh, I, uh, blah 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 blah, uh, Supara, and we're gonna compare. I wanna see. Not yet, but like you know, when I'm done with this. Now you may ask yourself, why is he detailing these crazy things? The answer <laughs> is that I hate myself and I just like to punish myself. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of what you expect with like a headpiece like that. Though. Yeah, I mean, she's like, I mean, I this is weird designs. This is a god god tier character. She just needs a god tier head headpiece, right? So like, you know. Yeah. It's, like, that's kind of the big part, too, is, like, it doesn't really, like, obviously, like, character has a little bit to do with it, like, who are they, who they are as a person, but, like, uh, clothing dictates status, too, right? Like, our, our brains are programmed to, like, understand when we see an article of clothing or an article of, of a character that, that's, like, uh, you know, that is part of their, of their, like, status, and uh yeah because you know because we all like that's kind of one of the reasons we all wear clothing is we all wear it because you know we we become you know fashionistas and whatnot whenever uh whenever we want to show off that our, our status in society that you know that's that's what we do it's kind of like peacocking exactly <laughs> exactly yeah desmond i'm picturing this like super crazy epic um like Wow, this looks so cool from back here. Oh my god. Oh, I just zoomed out and I'm like, damn, <laughs> did I draw that? Um, but yeah, like, uh, I'm just picturing this, like, epic scene where she's, like, in this room filled with pillars, but the pillars are, like, I don't know, like, some kind of crazy, like, material, like, I don't know. That's, that's like, the thought process that I have. Mm -hmm. Probably, like, 
I would imagine it would be beams of light with like Ooh. little scripts in it. Ooh. And it would be like information light and you just put your hand in and then that's how she like figure out the information she needs. Oh my god, that is I'm stealing that. Um you have been Isn't it you... fucking it? <laughs> I'm stealing your idea. Isn't that like such a fun concept? <laughs> On the spot, just now. <laughs> <laughs> that is no man. Sometimes like some that so that's why like it's so challenging um to be a content creator or not a content creator but like a yeah I guess content creator um but like because sometimes it feels like you have to block yourself off from everybody else to come up with original ideas but in all honesty like. We are we are all stronger together. Like we don't. It's so hard to like produce something in a vacuum, and so like having somebody to bounce mm -hmm. ideas off of uh, is incredibly important, and and it makes for such a like for such a, a good thing. I, think. I mean, I th I think that's like you know paramount to any kind of situation. Like when it comes to either creating something making something uh problem solving like it's better yeah. just to have more people around it is and that's honestly why i'm in the server <laughs> yeah yeah that yeah i'm stealing this idea for desmond's comic <laughs> here totally desmond's like yeah that's da the data pillars thing like fits her character so so well like that's such a cool idea and that is now yeeted I... into the comic congratulations we will we will credit you in the it will credit you in the in the uh thing just <laughs> like that one that one time like in the one panel it's actually you it's like <laughs> 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 abundance mindset yeah honestly i think there'll be quite a few panels that'll be using it uh because if i if i'm thinking of the scene how the scene's going to be um fairly epic we're gonna have the heroes talking with supara we're gonna have several other characters in there and uh and then like we're we're gonna do some like cosmic scale um uh switch ups where where like we show we show her like kind of like holding galaxies in her hand and shit like that you know like holding a planet in her hand and like you know flicking it away like you know dota played with the the idea of like having the souls these like huge powerful you know souls of dragons as like little tiny tiny like element balls like kind of swirling around the fucking wizard or whatever Ooh. he was and that's kind of cool so that can be like she can like probably condense planets and make them smaller <laughs> yeah well yeah. It, it's it's less than like have them floating around her you know yeah it's less that it's like so so like okay. when you think when you think about a, co a cosmic entity right like and i i put, right. apparently apparently i think about this a lot you know obviously super sophisticated man over here um no mm -hmm. but uh like when you think about a cosmic entity like our understanding of how the universe works is very limited because we we live in these three dimensions and we're kind of stuck in those right so but if you if you live outside of just our three dimensions like pulling a planet to you uh uh pulling a planet to you and like showing it showing off something like even if it's like physical or not like doesn't matter like it's it can all be done in a different like in a different way and so you can kind of like mm -hmm. I I don't know I I guess like I I've read a lot of like uh like cosmic horror type stories where like um the the entity itself can like you know manipulate space and time to the extent that like nothing is real but everything's real if that makes sense mm -hmm. like yeah like you're at you're at the same spot all at once yeah you're at every point like in the universe at the same happens. at the same yeah. time yeah exactly yeah yeah so like um i imagine like supara has just got this ability to like just you know even if it's even if it's just changing the per the point of view of the person who's seeing it like they're really seeing the real universe the real you know planet or whatever but it's all it's all like um it's all very different <laughs> than <laughs> with that it's kind of like a dream yeah yeah a real dream if you die in the dream you mm -hmm. die in real life wait no Inception, everyone. <laughs> <laughs>
Imagine. Dude, I love that movie. So many people hate that movie. My girlfriend, honestly, was like, eh, I'm not a fan. I'm like, no, I love that movie. It's my, it's my favorite. I, I actually, I never watched it. Really? Okay. I, I definitely, I would have taken you as someone who would love it, honestly. So maybe you, uh, <coughs> you should get on that. I probably would. Yeah. We'll see. It's like one of those movies that are like well known because it's just so popular. I'm just the one who missed it. You just didn't cap on that. Didn't hop on that bandwagon. I, I, I make the references, but like, I don't, <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. I mean, let's be honest. It's just a rip off of Nightmare on Elm Street, you know, if you're being real. So I have no idea. <laughs> no, I haven't seen those either. What are you no. even doing with your life? Oh my god. Uh, well, you're in luck. Uh, it's Halloween season. Watching there's, YouTube videos. <laughs> there's somebody somebody out there is uh is uh probably streaming uh, there's some streaming service out there that'll have the the Nightmare on Elm Street movies. So I'd, I'd give those a watch. Those are good. Yeah. I probably should. Just like because, like, why not? It's such, like, everybody knows it and would love to talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they, it's just, it's a cultural reference, right? Like, it's, even if you don't even, even if you don't enjoy it, right? Like, I mean, how could you not? But also, even if you don't enjoy it, it's it's just a cultural reference um, mm -hmm. that, uh, that, like, it's iconic. We all know, like, Freddy is, is a, an icon in our society, <laughs> as weird as that sounds. Yeah. Um, but... It's hard, like, getting away from the details. <laughs> are you start? Oh, in Chibi? Oh, yeah, no, no. You yeah. have to, you strip everything away. That's the way Chibi works. You have to pull all of those details that you're desperately trying to do. Because if you yeah. are like me, like, at the, it just, you want to, you just want to keep going. Oh, it just looks wrong. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. It sucks. Uh, I freaking hate, like, <laughs> Like, I see, I, like, I don't know how people do it, but, like, draw in a cute way. I know. You know, there's, I, like, a I science see it. to it or something. I, I swear to you, I, I'm in 100% agreement because I'm, like, I don't understand. <laughs> you, you, you drew four lines. I see those four lines. My brain hurts thinking about those four lines because it's, yeah. like, I don't understand how you managed to make those four lines look better than, like, you know anything I'm doing here <laughs> trying to draw something chibi it's so frustrating yeah. it's uh it's definitely I think a lot of it comes down to like people who are really really good at it honestly have just practiced it so much and they've they've done the thing where you you copy somebody else's work uh, like a lot of times and uh you just keep just keep practicing in the way of like you know just mm -hmm. you know, like um, that's how that's how anime and or I should say specifically manga artists do like they they get really good at at specific styles of manga. Um, so oh, right, that sorry. Go, going back to the queen being dead. Oh yeah, yeah. Do you, who do you think who who do you think is gonna be the like the queen queen or king now? Uh so we had we had this discussion. So it's it's now King Charles. Um, King, King Charles, Charles is, uh, he, I think he's the brother, son, I, you know what, uh, fuck if I know, I don't know the hierarchy. Yeah, I don't, like, now I'm kind of interested, but, like, do I want to put that effort? Yeah, mm, <laughs> the effort, the work, I don't know, a little yeah. tough, tough to know, um, but, yeah. Scary Terry? Yeah, do you know Scary Terry? Um. No. <laughs> wow! 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 Just not. <laughs> <laughs> having to look it up. Uh, oh my gosh! It's like the ballsack guy from the the show. The the what? <laughs> the ballsack guy. Yeah, from the uh, from a uh, what's it called? Rick and Morty. Oh yeah, he yeah. Has a okay. ball sack face <laughs> with a fucking tumor on one of the, the sacks. Are 
I've been watching people do the whole like line of symmetry uh, uh, drawings recently. Like uh, Yumi does these all the time, right? Like she'll she'll turn on that symmetry line and do do a perfectly sym uh, symmetrical drawing. And I'm always mm -hmm. like, man, that looks so good, but it feels like it feels wrong. It feels bad that it feels like you're cheating a little bit <laughs> cheating here. and and i'm like i shouldn't be i shouldn't have this attitude this is a bad attitude um yeah because it's like it's helpful it is so helpful because oh my god like and and also like this composition it's it is it's a symmetrical composition and it just looks so good like just the way that that symmetry makes it work so well is mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> he says to give you the coldest of shoulders. <laughs> what are you working on? I actually haven't checked anyone's stream in a in a minute here. So. Oh, I can't see yeah, you. I can't see what you're working on. Only links. Oh no, I'm the only one streaming. Never mind. I fuck me. I like. I would like to to stream it, but um, it's of my VTuber, and I'm trying to like keep her secret. Secret VTuber, like, got it. Yeah, it's kind of hard because I'm like, oh, it's pretty. I want to share. <laughs> oh, are you telling me? Um, Tyler is working on it. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's working on it. Yeah, he's working on it. It's cheat code. Pretty well. He's working on a combo with the one guy that's paying him hourly. He's paying him two hundred dollars a week to work on it. Um, he got another commission for a website and logo design that he got paid. Uh, that he's getting a thousand dollars for. Oh, I'm really excited for this first uh, email. He's got it's like really cute. Oh yeah, I hope that that concept artist guy gets back to me on that. Cause, uh, For what? There's um, there is a uh, concept or there's a there's a guy who contacted me to do concept art for a video game. However, I haven't heard back from him, and he was only like the preliminary stuff. He's like, oh, I love your stuff. I love your art. Um, mm. And uh, oh. Yeah, hopefully it goes through. Now that would be epic if we did a super VTube, a VTuber like uh, right, like that the goddess VTuber. Goddess VTuber. Oh damn! I don't know how to make a VTuber, but if I did, I would totally get on that. <laughs> maybe okay, I could. Okay, okay. Can maybe... I can I tell you a little bit about the VTuber? So I've been working on her for a while. Uh -huh. Is uh -huh. it okay? Go ahead. Okay. No, please do. I, I. What are you talking? About? Why are you asking me stupid questions? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um. Okay. Okay. Well, sometimes like I'll just talk and talk forever, and then like yeah. But um. I, have you been? In, I'm just sorry to interrupt again, but have you been in the same channel with me? Just checking because I'm okay. pretty sure I do that. I just wanna, I'm just you know you know. <laughs> I, never I I appreciate I appreciate you for asking if you are being a bother, but no, you are never a bother. Please continue. Aww. Okay, so so for for my character, I think I'm gonna toy with the idea that so she's gonna, you know, um, you know that term where you get transferred to another world. Oh yeah, uh, isekai. Isekai. So she gets is isekai to our planet mm. from a planet where... So, like, the reverse, right? Reverse isekai! So Hell yeah! Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I have not she, seen... I have not seen enough of those. I need more. Um, there's... It's pretty... It's a fun concept because it's like, you know, how are they going to deal with this world versus, yep. like, from where they came from? Yeah, um, one of my favorites... I, I actually like the manga quite a bit better than I liked the anime. But it's uh, the mm. devil's a part timer. Mm. Have you seen that? I I heard, seen a little bit of the anime. Really funny. It's That's just it's just saying. cute and funny. Like it's just ridiculous, yeah. over the top. Like you know, it's these characters that are trying to survive in a daily life in our world, and like 
-hmm. Well, it's pretty hard, epic honestly. <laughs> yeah, and then and then they have epic battles every now and again, and you're like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah but like the the epic battles are definitely treated uh treated with the same like um the same like what is that? Uh, kind of nonchalance is the is the regular drama, right? Like, the... yeah. <laughs> so I like, I like these epic fucking god battles are yeah. just like another fucking day is like working at McDonald's. It really is. Like his he has much harder time working at McDonald's than he does taking on some. Yeah. <laughs> but um, but yeah. So um, that what was I saying? Oh, continue your story. I'm sorry. I like broke you oh, it's okay right. um what, what was i gonna say so so she gets isekai to our planet and she has to deal with people like trying to make her into a goddess because she looks so you know exotic and she has horns and whatnot um <laughs> oh they're all they're all like oh so is she like is she kind of in the past then? and she's she... like no stop it's so... like, i'm not your fucking god or anything. is this is this is she in the past or is she in the present like in modern day no. so it would be epic way... if it was modern day so, <laughs> so it's kind of, i'm working with this concept i don't know if it's solid yet um but what i was thinking is so when she got isekai to our planet I'm deriving this inspiration from like the the Lost Paradise poem, the epic poem. Oh, par Paradise Lost. Yeah, 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 yeah. Par um, yeah, yeah. So in that in that epic poem, they were saying like, "Oh, the angels fell for like nine days," mm -hmm. and I was thinking like, "Well, since she's coming from like a total different universe, like how about it's pretty much like uh, a good part of." she she's falling next to earth like she's a comet and so her physical form is still out in space Ooh. where her spiritual form yeah her spiritual form is already on the planet so that kind of explains why you don't get any like historical facts from like oh the sighting of a of a dragon creature right 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 because she she was experiencing like the greek uh, times and like the Egyptian times and all those like ancient civilization times like as a spiritual form and then uh, like I think in the 19 sorry the 1500s she finally like her physical form lands on earth and like some of her adventures are like when she was a pirate and she would have to disguise herself to like not I, know that she's a demon yeah i want this then, can like, you make it can you make it real please do it now yeah and then like whenever she so she like hides away so like what's a great place to hide in a big forest the amazon right 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 and so that's where that's where she finds like her first like cult following <laughs> oh no <laughs> why do like, i no, stop it. you know what's funny is like the modern they don't have... yeah since they don't have like a written language like there's no evidence of it does sound like cosmic but horror like, i agree um yeah so it's like it's kind of like it's a fun concept to work with i i am in love with this concept please do more and make it like mm -hmm. really fun that sounds I, great uh also i imagine i, I, I imagine I, that the modern day equivalent of of a of a cult following is just a uh, a social media influencer right so yeah, she'd be yeah. <laughs> she'd be an influencer She's like, stop it guys <laughs> i'm done with this work <laughs> I she, am like, in love with the sound so <laughs> And then, like, another thing is, like, her personality is definitely, like, old-worldy because she kind of, for, like, there was an incident uh, when, like, modern, like, steam engine uh, technology was coming about, okay, the cowboy era. Oh, of course. <laughs> I'm going to have a cowboy, cowboy version of her. Uh, but she you know has an incident there and realize like oh i need to like remove myself from society kind of thing oh step away so she's, yeah like, okay. on a, yeah so she's on an island pretty much like the whole time until she's like released again right and then that's when she becomes the vtuber hell yes I need this in my life. I want to watch all of the episodes. Yeah. Please release it now. Yeah. It's like, it's kind of, like, I'm, I've been thinking about this for a year or more. So it's just like all these things. It's a very rich concept. 
I Indeed. Have for this person. Indeed. Definitely sounds that way. It's those it's Mr. those Pepper? passion. <laughs> no? What? Oh hey. I'm, like, Hi. I'm using the, the cat. I love the cat. I I need the I love your cats, my Mr. Pepper. Your cats are so amazing. Mm -hmm. Oh, I need to grab that one that you sent me and show. Um, so my my boss is uh, watching my stream. I'm gonna show him what you do because you do some amazing work, and I want him to send you money or something. I don't know. Listen, listen. I know you are like, oh, Maybe the cats, no. the cats, the butt cats. Oh, is he still here? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, Mr. Pepper. Sorry, I thought you said he's gone. <laughs> I missed that. Oh. Um. But yeah, no, the like, you deserve to get money off of this. I'm not even kidding. Like, maybe just set up. You know what it is? Just set up a Patreon. Oh my god, you sent me another one, and they're so cute. Anyway. This is the fan art of Cult of the Lamb. It's a game. I like the game. Yeah, that's that's such a cute thing. God damn it. Um, uh, let's see if I can. Send this over to Desmond real quick. Oh shit! Yumi's Yumi's saying she got COVID. No. No. Wait, did you already? No, because I. All right, Desmond, check this out. Where is my? Where are you? Oh my god, I messaged so many people since yesterday. Yeah, he does these he does these butt cat designs like all day. It's amazing. And I love it. Yeah, they're pretty fun. Guys, are we ready to to ink this bad boy? Did that happen? Did that happen in just this just this couple hours? I mean, to me it looks already inked. I know it does. It does have a lot of that, like. It has that. I don't know. It. I mean, it's got a nice loose style to it, which I could just kind of go with. Maybe I just apply. My, my suggestion is like to color it, shade it, add like additional details on top of it to make it sharper. Okay. But yeah, uh, it kind of like cuts out like a, a step that won't. Like, line art, to me, is pretty much a step that gets rid of detail. It does, in a lot of ways. But makes it cleaner. Yeah. It does make it cleaner, though. Yeah, maybe yeah. we just go for the color. I think uh, I think she's ready. She's ready. I think so, too. Yeah. Them Looks good. What, what, does, what is it? What'd you say, Pepper? I'm not good with names and memory, so I don't know. Oh, oh okay. reminds me of the face. She looks like something. She looks like something. She also. <laughs> she she reminds me of the angels from uh, Hellboy. Ooh, yeah, wow. yeah. The um that yeah. definitely that that character at the at the beginning or at the end of Hellboy two. Um. I uh, that's uh Del Toro's. I I I fancy myself a little little Del Toro fanboy, so I can uh, mm -hmm. get behind that. Getting compared to getting compared to him at all is like. I'll just draw something, I guess. I want to redraw Nirvana. Oh, use yeah, use the butt face cat for that one. Nirvana cover, but but the butt face cat. Yeah, like the <laughs> yes, face please. Cat. Yes, please. Okay. Sure. Why not? Dude. I love Nirvana so much. You don't know. Just a lot. Dude, earlier today I was trying to get like. At some... least you like good music. <laughs> so much people like doesn't like good music anymore. Oh, I know, right? 
Um, yeah. I'm here for the rock. I'm here for the, you know, intense. Not the, <laughs> not the fucking, how do you even dance to, like, fu d dubstep or whatever. <laughs> I don't like the I, it's like I I was a kid at one point and you know that shit slapped then but not anymore. <laughs> doesn't have quite so the same like, doesn't doesn't drop quite the same way, you know. It's more it's more like an experience rather than like a thing you can dance to. Yeah. And yeah. you know, I, 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 I get behind I'll get behind it every now and again, but experience. like Yeah. Yeah. Like EDM. I like house EDM. I, I like vocals, but I don't know. Damn. I think I I am really different when it comes to music. But it's fine. You you like your cultural music? No. What, what kind of music doesn't do you like, like cultural music? Got it. <laughs> hey, I like I like the Armenian uh, music. That we like with the Armenian flute is really pretty. I don't like the you know the recent Arabic music. I think like it's not the thing that I like. What I like mm. is yeah. Frank Sinatra, <laughs> things like that. Uh, Elton John. Kind of like old rock music. Yeah, and the uh, old music in general. Respectable. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's really hard to communicate with people my age. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Does she like Elton John? Of course. That's good. I like uh, David Bowie a lot. Like so nice. much. That's a that's fun one. Choice. Yeah, yeah, that's a fun one. That's one of the. I don't know. I think he's one of the best looking humans on earth. Like, it's not even a lie, though. That's. Just, I mean. Well, it, I'm not you could. Argue. You could say he's one of the best looking humans, but you'd just be wrong because we're pretty sure he's not human. So. <laughs> <laughs> he's he's ethereal. He's trans. He's transcended humanity. He's, he's from the Feywild. Yes. That's that's the best way to explain it. That is a hundred percent. It's the only way. <laughs> the only way. Must be. It must be a Fey. Yeah. Human? Nah, he's a fae! <laughs> the he's goddamn fairy! Like, you know, anyway. <laughs> I think he's a cool artist. Uh, yeah, he's cool. Oh yeah, he's great. His work is nice, I think. They're the underrated. Especially nowadays, I mean. Well, yeah, most know. most kids, people especially are, people are younger forgetting. younger people, don't really care about him. But I I think that he, I don't think he's underrated though, because I do think there's still enough of a following for him. But um, but yeah, it's it's a, you know, it happens. Tiny Girl is my favorite song. So you're gonna I generate love that song so much. Right? I sing it a lot. Wait, which one? China Girl. China Girl. Huh? I don't I'm actually unfamiliar myself with it but yeah I'm not hold on John Trying to figure out for colors what we want to do. Honestly, I think we go like gray tones with like lighting. Yeah. 
I have the uh, SpongeBob. Um, shoot, what's that song called? Oh, 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 oh. Little Where he like, I uh, comes up the. Uh, so, uh, kind of, uh, where he, like, comes up this, like, they raise him up onto the stage, and he, like, performs this epic rock song. Why can't I think of it what it's called? Something else, maybe. Maybe I should change Maybe, maybe, yep, stop drawing all butt cats, draw something completely new. No more butt cats, butt cats are dead. Just kidding. I, that would make me so sad. Never kill the buckheads. Uh, I'll draw something else now. Just for fun. Ooh, he's thinking red, black, green. That's a fun song. Which song? You mean the uh, one that I'm Girl. Yeah. yeah. Uh, right now, right now I'm kind of into Wolf Mother. Uh, they're like a really fun band. I don't think I've heard of them. I'll have to look them up. Uh, Joke, yeah, Joker and the Thief is like their most popular song. Uh, I like that one and Woman. Uh, oh, I'm trying to think what's the thing that I'm listening to a lot nowadays. I also listen to um, Apache or Apache. Yeah, I don't he's Apache? he's EDM. But he has like a lot of Renaissance inspiration. He literally has a album called the Renaissance. I uh, I listen to nothing but Flow Rider all day. Thank you very much. Low Rider? <laughs> no, Flow. Well, Flow Rider. <laughs> flow Rider. Flo <laughs> flow Rider. Yeah, Flow Flo Rider. Uh, obviously, I'm kidding because I can't even pronounce his name okay. right. But you know, <laughs> <laughs> I, thought that, I thought Flow Rider was like actually one. <laughs> All my friends call me Low Rider. Low Rider. What the hell? I literally higher. found a video from the from Flow Rider. Uh, search on YouTube, where it's just a guy recording girls uh, doing the wave ride at the water park. That's um, an interesting... <laughs> that's and interesting. He commentary. Is he, like, giving them scores based on how, like, wavy their arms were? Or, <laughs> like, what is happening? He, like, the first two girls that I just saw were, like, Oh, he just she just dove right in and wipe out. Oh. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> He's like narrating them like, oh, it, she thinks it's a right side this problem, but it's actually just her skill. It's not possible. I'll send it in our stream to think that I'm loving it. Something from Roblox, even though I don't like that thing. Ah, oh my God, not Roblox, no. <laughs> Roblox, but this is funny. Look at this. All right, let me see. I did it my way. Today. <laughs> <laughs> Like more than 12 times. Yeah. Well, now that the PRB everything is done, just let me know when I get the box. Kind of mounts her on. <laughs> the fucking commentary. The breeze. 
low rider get a little higher Man, this is gonna look so cool. Colored in. Oh god, I can't wait. Why does this have so many fucking views? And why am I still watching it? <laughs> <laughs> wait, why am I still watching it? <laughs> oh my god, I love. Uh, it's not unusual by Sir Tom Jones. I love this song so much. <laughs> we drive in gay. Was, <laughs> I think my dad was 20 or something back when this song got released. Yeah. You know what's a good classic song for me? Uh, any... I have to look it up. Oh god, how it. aged are you going to make me feel? The, the, guy, the guy who did Brother Louie. Um, why am I not Her remembering brother. this? It's like an old European song. Hello, Sherry. Uh, Sherry, baby. <laughs> what? Are you doing more celery today? Or are we out of time? Uh, we're out of celery. So, lettuce. Beep, boop, beep, boop, 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 boop. I'll just throw something and I will do this. Because that's what I. Yeah. It was actually really good for me because um, I was doing, I, I took a lot of breaks from drawing this today um, just to kind of like pull my head back and not be in my own brain about like the design. Mm -hmm. And I think that was a really positive thing to do just based off of my design here. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's why I have so many unfinished projects is because like, Oh, I get bogged down with one, mm -hmm. so I start another. Get bogged down with that one, do another. Yep. Yeah, this one was, it was definitely a matter of I just had to keep going at it, like going at it, but I needed breaks between like going at it. Oh no, not this song. I love pink shoelaces, you know that song? Let's get some shoes. Yeah. No, I don't know that song. Pink shoelaces. Huh? It's so old, I think it's from the 40s or the 50s, one of those. So, he wears pink shoes with pink shoe glasses. That doesn't sound like a 40s song, but I could be wrong. Where's, where's my nostalgia play? Oh, there it is. God, I have to... What? You don't know pink shoe glasses? I think it's so old. From... I want to see... Not that old. <laughs> Oh, do you know Modern Talking? Thank you, Les. I have to see. It's from 1961. Okay. Nailed it. Yeah. I was like, I know what That's 40s. Than my mom. I know what 40s music sounds like. You can't, you can't trick me. Yeah. Do you guys know Modern Talking with like Sherry Sherry Lady? I yeah. Sherry Sherry Lady. Yeah, lady going through the motions. Nothing to be fine. I love that song. Yeah, me too. I listen to that. It's a German song, right? I uh, like your opinion, whatever they are. You know, all those, all those white people over there. <laughs> <laughs> One of them. <laughs> but like, aren't uh, what's it called? Romanian people are? Are you? Do you consider them white? Uh, they're darker toned uh, skin for sure. Um, I I would still I think. But they're like European. Yeah, they they are still fairly um, like light skinned comparatively to some. But yeah. I don't know. It is it is interesting though because I actually do know a few who have like they've straight up been confused with like Hispanic people, and it's like, mm -hmm. no, you're wrong. But all right. <laughs> um, Oh, it's always fun when I was younger and I, I allowed myself to get more tan. Um, I would get people talking to me in Spanish and like. <laughs> They'd be like I, assuming. I don't even know. I don't even know like what to say. I think that happened to me. Just uh, nod your head and go, see, see. Can be 
people thought I'm Mexican once. No. Uh, yeah. Where, 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 Middle Eastern like people have a or? have a very similar skin tone. Although, uh, although I will say I definitely can tell the difference. So it's funny when people are like, "Oh, you must be from Mexico," and I'm like, "No, they're clearly not." But all right. Yeah. Um. It's funny when it's obvious, guys, I guess. I don't know. Go ahead, have sorry. Have you guys also uh, listened to Desert Rose? That's a classic for me. Of course. Yeah, obviously. Fucking love, love Desert Rose. We need more music like that. It speaks to my soul. My mom would, like, fucking lose her, lose her shit, like, when I would come on the CD. Because, you know, we had CDs back then. <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> so, like, she would make mixtapes for, like, her parties. And she would be like, oh, my gosh, it's Desert Road. <laughs> and, like, I would come in, my sister would come in, and, like, everyone, like, all her friends would come in and just, like, fucking jam out. Nice. That's a good song. Thank you, Clip Studio, for saving automatically. It is disruptive, I'm not going to lie, but I still appreciate it. Ooh, I should see if I could play this song on audio serve. I'm like distracting myself so much from what I'm supposed to Oh my God. <laughs> Rose. Oh yeah, when did you do um when did you do that uh that profile picture? Was that just the other day? Or was that Uh Yeah. I think it was like yesterday. Wow. What? You've gotten faster, not gonna uh, lie. The cat picture? No 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 no, not the cat one. The one the one you showed me before. Are you talking to me? Nope, never mind. I'm lying about who you are. <laughs> okay, because I had an album. That cover, Desert Rose uh, song. I don't know the artist. By Sting and Shed Monley. Oh, I. Uh... By accident, I drew a butt cat. <laughs> <laughs> it's all. It's all. Your <laughs> he can no longer draw <laughs> anything else. <laughs> it's too much of a muscle memory. <laughs> it's been programmed. Yeah. Oh man. Just like a doodle. Mm -hmm. Do it like a super superhero cap, but you know, I don't know. I told you, but cat is a design because so they can be whatever people want them to be. Mm -hmm. So that's the case. Dude, this feels like some AI generated art right here. What am I even? Am I even human? <laughs> it's so cool, you and you like your art. BS. I didn't pass that last Stay captcha. Higher. Now I'm not. Now I'm not so sure. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna play Audio Star for a little bit. I have to figure out if this song is good or not. See you guys later. See you. In the sweet red. The computer cannot handle this brush, and it's just a basic brush. Hmm. 
Yeah, I don't think I want to add green to this. No green. That's a camp. Someone's building token. I think it's gonna have to be red, black, and gold. I just think that's just that's the way it's gonna have to be. Oh God. Mom, Dad, I'm gay. Hi, gay, I'm Dad! <laughs> no. <laughs> no! Oh, no. Hi. Hi. Who's there? I've been talking to myself. Sounds again. like fun. <laughs> Sounds like a good time. That's what I tend to do. Yeah, I was trying to talk to you guys. But... Well, <laughs> get wrecked, I guess. No, no yeah, talking. No, no talking in this in this voice chat server. We don't allow that kind of shit. <laughs> um, it happens sometimes. It had that. Get slow battery, and then like the mic kind of turns off, 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 and I forget that. And I try to talk to people, I get ignored, and then and then you get frustrated, <laughs> and then yeah, I got you. I think it's it's your PC or something. No, it's my mm, uh, headset. It always does it. I, I just need to just change on like I want to be able to talk. Again. Ooh, I have made a slight miscalculation in these colors. Uh mm. they are very McDonald's esque. And I have seen <laughs> it and I cannot unsee it and now I'm now I must do a color adjustment layer over top of everything so that I do not see that anymore. <laughs> I mean, when you add more, like, glam on the gold, maybe it stops, like, looking like McDonald's. 
you may have a point, but I'm still not trusting it. You don't trust don't trust the Nazis. Don't trust the process. <laughs> trust the process. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, yeah, if I add some green into the gold, then we're actually okay. Hell yeah. Scared, it scared me for a minute, for a full minute though. <laughs> At least a whole minute. Understandable. Imagine making a goddess and then making her a McDonald's theme. <laughs> Mick goddess over here. Guys, I have to bye. Okay, bye. Bye. This color is called Choka. We could make her white instead of black. Wow, is that so? I mean, it makes it less McDonald's. -y, all right, look, anything for the <laughs> 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 anything to escape that <laughs> fate. <laughs> Understandable. I definitely yeah. I feel like this is actually could be working. Heritage Service Center. Service Center looks really good. I'm not thinking about McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, it's still making you hungry. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> it's too McDonald's y. <laughs> I'm only eating, eating at McDonald's like twice. In your whole life? Damn. Yeah. That's something. This weekend we have a better fast food chain burger place. What, could be, what could be better than McDonald's? Just a kidding. Lot of yeah, I was gonna say just totally <laughs> kidding. <laughs> totally just kidding. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not feeling the white. I feel I really liked the gray. I have changed my mind. We're going all the way back. Shit, I hope I can go all the way back. <laughs> okay, we're good. We're in good shape. Yeah, like we're just gonna stick with this. This gray is super nice and I don't wanna change it, so it's a, it's really nice contrast too. Mm-hmm. With the colors. The heck? Nani? What? What's up? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I 
tonight I fucked up with the perspectives again. Oh, that's fine. Did you need another lesson in perspective? No, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I think about that, I'm like, how many times do we need to teach you this lesson, old man? <laughs> Except that I'm the old man who's getting beat because he doesn't know his perspective. <laughs> <laughs> Like when I try to like draw further away, you know, the lines get smaller and smaller, so I can't really follow them that well. So it gets a little confusing. But you did not. Hmm? Yeah. What did I do? Me. Yeah. <laughs> get back, son. It's got choked in a wrestle way. Oof, my computer cannot handle this brush at the moment. I think I know what the actual problem is, though. I think it has to do with my hard drive size. I don't know enough of computers to know. Hey. Oh. Is this still confusing? I'm Doug Dimmodome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimmodome. The Dig Dome? Also known as the owner of the Dimmod Park. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, she's got some she got some curves. Oh, hey. That is oh, still is so McDonald's-y. Oh, God what? damn it. It's not. Look, I've seen it. It is now unseeable. Un-unseeable. I don't know what I'm saying now. See, I don't even know words. <laughs> Completely <laughs> lost all ability to do anything. This is my life. <laughs> Thank you. 
<laughs> McDonald's has destroyed your art career. It's just it's not my fault that they picked such a nice color scheme. Jeez. I mean, it is a nice color scheme. Just need to do a goddess based on Burger King. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> it's too good. I have to now. <laughs> the different goddesses. What can I do in the background so it doesn't just look like boxes? Ooh, but watch this. This is actually one of my favorite things to do. Um, it's like adding the glow, or uh, so you know how to do like you know how to do like atmospheric um fog on on stuff. No. I uh, hear a so selection. I like start digital art. Invert. This week. No. So I don't do anything. atmospheric fog occurs when an object is in like when I uh, there's like air between two objects, right? Um. And uh, what that what that basically ma makes is uh the object behind it becomes lighter than the object in front of it. So. In concept art, you can kind of trick this effect, or not trick it, but like make it more pronounced. Oh, I'm doing this on the wrong layer. Well, that was a mistake. Um, so like, so that it pops the front object out of the other object. Like so. I see. You only have to do it around certain things. Like it's like in, in rendering techniques, like you should do it like in a very even way where everything is rendered up properly. Um, but this is a really quick way to fake it, so <laughs> you know. Mm -hmm. What are you drawing on? Hmm? <clears throat> uh, what are you drawing on? Like, are you drawing on a tablet or a pen display? Uh, pen display. Um, my laptop uh, has touch surface. Oh my god! Fancy. A little bit. Doesn't like to do more than one thing though. So like, you try to get. I, I'm trying to do streaming and this, and it's like, I don't know how to do anything now. I have forgotten my purpose like as a computer. <laughs> oh. uh, can you hear me? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. I got that notification again. From my headphones. Hi. Hello. Oh, is that Yumi? No. 
sweet radness. Oh, is that a bird? It's just radness, sweet radness mm -hmm. back. Thank you, thank you, sir. I appreciate that. Um, it's almost, it's getting, it's getting there. It's getting to the point I want it to be at. Am I cheating? Is that why I didn't care about that? I'm cheating. Wow. wow. What's that? I'm cheating. You're cheating. I'm the one and cheating I'm over here. <laughs> Okay. Maybe I should draw some light sources. Mm. Or a billboard. No. Or the lights. Sure. I kind of want to make her skin gold. Like, that's like the very goddessy thing to do, right? Yeah. At least shimmery of some kind. Yeah, I don't like how maybe... it looks like that, but maybe, um, yeah, no, doing definitely shimmery. Like Make her bling. Give her, just, she just is bling, just n nothing but bling. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's become bling. I am ice. <laughs> You got some eyes? No, I have the eyes. So, Crow. Yeah. You know how you're like, <laughs> uh, like, like always to do with something really quick and like time yourself and all this stuff. Mm-hmm. So, so the idea of that is to get as much practice as you can, right? A so, big part of it, like, yeah. So what I've been doing, um, I've been drawing in my journal again. And I'm actually like really quick when it comes to um, just like laying down my ideas with graphite. And I think what I'm going to do is draw in my book as much as I can and post that on my Instagram. And oh, there you go. Yeah, doing yeah, doing like hand drawing things is so good. Mm -hmm. And it's usually a lot faster. Oh, me. yeah. Like, it gets my concepts down that I have. With digital, it's like really hard to not color it or do this or that you have all the with, tools at your fingertips so it's so tempting yeah. not to, like just to use them right like you just want to yeah with a pencil it's like okay that's all i got yep <laughs> all i could do is sketch and shade I actually have quite a few uh, pictures that I really want to, that I'll probably like work on posting for my Instagram and maybe even like saying commissions are open there too and get that track going. Should this whole thingamajig be yellow? I feel like yes, but don't know. God, every time I add a little bit more yellow, it's like, even more McDonald's! You know what? 
that's it. I can't. I just, I just need to make I these black it's more instead like of yellow. Sinata. These are just going to be. These are just going to be gray instead of yellow. That's an easy peasy way to fix that. Oh man. Yeah, that's that. a lot. That's a little better. I know what you're. I know because like it's it's a it's literally a problem with like what I'm seeing. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's the artist. The artist to see. I, I, I've seen something that I can't unsee, and now it's that's permanently in my brain. So, you know, in my I life. See the pokeballs. I know, right? Aren't they cute? Yeah, I know. I can't unsee those either. <laughs> I was, I was like, I was like, what if she had like drones like flying around her? And then I'm like, uh, maybe this is not the best way to go. But you know what? We're doing it anyway. So. Yeah, it, it, you're laying down what, what you intend, and that's yeah. all. We can ask for. Yeah, I just, I want, I know I want her skin to be like metallically shiny. But she just still. had a highlight, a shit ton of highlights and a, a lot of contrast. That's how I cheat with metal. <laughs> That's how I cheat with metal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what it is? I can turn this into a... Is it lighten layer? I think that's what I want to do. It's not hard to draw a chibi, so it shouldn't be taking me so long. No, that's not what I want to do. Did okay, did Mr. Pepper seem a little bit sad to you? Um, it's hard to know. Maybe yeah. he seemed a little out of sorts. Yeah, I don't know. It just makes me like think like, oh, is it just me who thinks that you know this or that, or is it just normal? It's really hard to know. Yeah. Okay, so I have a sketch of the waving emo, like saying hello. Uh, what else should I have? Coolidge. found the layer thing I needed it's the sc uh, the screen mode because that way my my lines stay visible mm -hmm. It's so cute. Whenever she wants attention, she just like comes to my neck and starts nuzzling it. Oh god, no! It's so it cute. It is so, so cute. So like, what's what's a Twitch emote that has to be there? What do you mean by it's like Twitch tw emote that has to be there? Like, uh, like if you had a select few to choose from. Uh, which ones like have to be the ones to be an email? Oof, that's tough. Yeah, because there's like the waving one, there's the pog, <laughs> there's the notification one, hype, I don't know.
Justin. Oh. Agreed. Agreed. Hello. Hi. Uh, I think it's kind of fun when Tarkin looks disgusted. Yeah. Like when when they go like the they do the like crazy hyper realistic style inside the cartoon that's supposed yeah, to be for kids. Yeah. yeah, I I get yeah, disturbed it's, so it's much funny. by that. I love it. <laughs> it's so fun. That's peak oh. humor, according to me. Yeah. What can I so like you use the hyper realistic emotes? <laughs> I don't know if they were referring to that or not. <laughs> it's hard to say. Uh, like, I, I, I don't know. Well, just like a disgusted face. Wait. Uh, um, let's see if I can find a picture. That's what I can find. Or I should say, like, what should be my next emote that I draw now? Like, what kind of expression? disgusted nose up emote like yeah I'm, like i'm better than you <laughs> do you think that's yeah. my personality <laughs> <laughs> no okay just like when it happens <laughs> um that's, kind of that could, i kind of like that because that kind of ties into the personality yeah yeah, you have to keep, keep my eyes I'm just, I'm just trying to give you an idea. I don't think that's how you know. No, I think I'm so, I, no, I, I was joking. <laughs> yeah, my type of humor is like really dry. <laughs> like though, when I just stumbling, I do a lot of those kind of faces. It's very fun. Like just after disgust. As if someone shat beside you. Dude, I could I could render on this for like probably years. <laughs> I probably need to stop myself because I <laughs> I've used a lot of time, a lot of my time on this. It happens. I mean, it does, right? Like that's something too. Is like especially with concept stuff, like you've got to be prepared for it to take longer than the allotted amount of time for a good concept. Yeah. yeah. I look for this good. Thank you. It took me a long time to get to this point, so yes, thank you. <laughs> Were you working Sorry, on the... No. Uh, what was it? Two days ago, you were working on the warrior guy with on yep. Switch? Yep. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So, no. should her arms be crossed while she's, like, staring down at you? Uh, um... Or is it, like, a disgusted face? Well, how big is the canvas size? If it's a uh, I... It's, like, 200 by 2... Sorry, 2,000 by 2,000. Oh, okay, pretty big. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> that's cute that you think that's big. <laughs> for an emo yeah you're more, you like shrink it down to like uh what what is it like 128 pixels all the way down to 25 i feel like she should be like holding a coffee with her pinky out or a tea with her pinky out like, oh that's a good idea yeah i actually or really like that, like that. Like a little tea so you just needed you just needed a legit twitch streamer to actually like give you an idea here Thank you. Like, that's actually such a great idea. Aw, oh, did you call me a legit Twitch streamer? I don't know. But you're probably more are, legit are Twitch streaming than, than we are, so, you know. No, 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 no. <laughs> what? Okay, okay, okay. So, looking disgusted, huh? Chibi. Looking... <laughs> Google it. <laughs> How else are you supposed to figure out what that looks like? I gotta, I gotta have references. 
trying to think of a. Oh, that's a good one. Oops. It's like uh, the pink-haired one, not Ren or Rem. One of those two. Raul. In the anime. Raul and Rem. Yeah. The pink. Yeah. I know that. I, I don't know that anime by heart, and I don't know every <laughs> female character in it. Don't worry about it. ReZero is actually one of my... I, I thought that was one of the best animes that came out at its time. Is it? I thought so. Did, did you... Have you seen it? No. I am a particular fan. Have you seen One Piece? Whenever someone says that to me, I just want to, like run and scream I'm, out my window and like face dive out of it oh well, you don't like this yeah where's where's my where is where's where is my disgusted <laughs> disgusted emote is that a can i have that please <laughs> <laughs> um, it's actually really good no i know it so, is I, I know a lot of people sure. it's, like, it's just too hard for us to get into it yeah 800 episodes or something like that, right? I mean, I Dude, did do that. It, I did do that with Naruto. It fucking flies by. I tell you, it fucking flies by. I am consuming this content, like, as fast as possible when it comes out. And, like, like I'm starting pretty much at the same point as you guys did, but, like, um, we can't, we don't have all the episodes because it's Netflix. Which curse really you, sucks. Netflix. Curse you. <laughs> One Piece is Netflix. I'm like literally day and night just always watching One Piece. And like the thing is, like it's not a major commitment like some of the new Netflix shows are, where like each episode could be like an hour, right? And that to me is like a huge commitment to put into a show for one, like for like an evening. But One Piece, I can watch like a few episodes and be like, yeah, I need to go do something now. And what, like maybe. Like a few episodes have been passed or something, and like I still get. I would always just see spoilers though, like. Yeah, like you know. story progression. Yeah, like I, I don't, I don't like how I already know the, the time jump, designs the new, no. you know, well, after you, the time skip. You just spoiled it all. Yeah, wow, well, <laughs> wow, well, spoiled. It's over. Can't watch it. <laughs> Canceled. Yeah! I like it. I like it a lot. It's I fun. It's it, and I think, like, uh, oh, uh, it's kind of satirical. They're talking about, they're talk we were talking about One Piece. <laughs> My client, uh, Desmond, was wondering what we were talking about. <laughs> no, uh, Desmond, I love One Piece. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> it's totally great. <laughs> well, like, the, the animation's ass. Like, it is actual ass. <laughs> But it's like been inspiring me like well if they have ass animation at least they're bringing it out like putting it on the yeah table. it's it's like it's, it's still there money. right and how many millions of yeah. dollars are those people like you know richer now <laughs> you know right. like the story has been set and they just run along with it that's actually something that i wish i could get more artists to understand is like honestly like yes okay i believe that the better your art is, the more likely you are to get clients and everything like that. So I should, I, I think you should always keep practicing. But really, what's more important, if you, especially if you're a, a story-driven um, artist, mm -hmm. just start making it. Don't hesitate to do mm -hmm. it. I, I'm, I shouldn't be talking like this because I'm literally the worst, you know, follower of my own advice. But like, you know, if you, if you wait, it's never going to get out there, and it's never like. I don't know. I, I can't explain it, but like. Well, it's it's pretty much like a missed opportunity. That's all it is. Yeah. You know, like, how do you know if you don't try? And that's a part of that's actually a lot of what One Piece is about. How do you know? It's very oh, honest. She's cycled, she's super, super. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I'm in trouble, guys. I might have to watch I might have to watch one speed one piece now. Wow. Like you almost have to watch an episode just because Just now, yeah, just because of this. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean it's true though. I'm not fucking like lying though. It's a great it's a great inspirational show. That's all I have to say. I believe you. I believe it. Believe it. 
I'm just not gonna. I'm not gonna watch it despite you. Despite, despite you now. Oh, no. I I mourn. Oh, I mourn God. for your loss of uh loss of entertainment. Chance of entertainment. Right. Right. No, I'm just kidding. I I'm a graphics whore. It has to be good enough animation for me to. I, I I am too. Yo, like yo. that's the thing. I am too. Like fucking Demon Slayer. Oh, like sure the story, whatever. But the fucking visuals. Yeah, like everything for me. Uh, Castlevania, definitely the reason why I kept watching it. Um, so, so y'all y'all seen y'all seen a little anime called uh, called uh, Mob Psycho One Hundred? Oh yeah, of oh, course. Huh. Yeah. That's, I love like talk about one how like some visuals. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I love how like out of the box um, animation they, they yeah it, it was crazy creative. and super good. I loved it. Yeah. That was uh that was probably so that's, that that's why that's why like first season of uh One Punch Man was so good. Yeah. Because they they allowed the so they got art students like straight out of college and like show what you can do. And they allowed them and bam, fucking everyone loves the first season but not the second because of the they got <laughs> that... more pro quote unquote professional team. <laughs> Who needs professional? It just fucking killed the whole like artistic the vibe. representation. Oh no. Yeah. <sighs> fucking hate that shit. Yep. All right, I think I'm gonna call this one um, for concept wise. Oh, my uh, Desmond says the best anime is Hunter X Hunter, and I actually I can agree with that. I I can see that. I think that's a better storyline than than One Piece is. Oh, one, one piece, piece one piece is all about like the the story of adventure of being out there and one out like hunter x hunter actually has like real plot <laughs> okay yeah that's maybe that's what i'm kind of getting and is like yeah. the vibe the vibe of like i i'm not because maybe that's it is like i actually don't enjoy a lot of like content that is like each episode's its own self-contained little story and there's like yes maybe they progress a larger plot but it's not like a huge amount and it takes forever to like get anywhere <laughs> so one piece may not yeah, appeal to me like, in that sense like literally what one piece does sometimes is literally have a whole episode dedicated to the climax which i mean that's fine and all but when it's literally just like oh, we were talking about like how powerful this guy and how weak this person is or how they could, you know, problem solve this situation. Just that for a whole episode is kind of like... <laughs> we could do this. Maybe we could do this or <laughs> this. <laughs> and then does yeah, none of it, it and does something completely it, different. <laughs> and they will like actually have a couple of episodes like this. So when they were, when Luffy was trying to go against the, uh, the electric guy, the God, um, and it was literally like five episodes of like them trying to figure out like how to defeat this guy. And sure, like, his cronies were, you know, part of each episode, but still, it's like, the fucking amount of anticipation for something that you want so badly is, like, strong within this series. Like, I wanted that guy, that electric guy, like, dead for so long, because he's such an ass, but, like... So it's just like, oh, is it gonna be this? Anime. Yeah, is it gonna be this episode? No. Is it gonna be this episode? No. <laughs> you know, it just sucks. Okay, cool. Gigabyte has approved my um my return thing. All right, I'll be right back. Mm -hmm.
And every time I switch my pen around to the eraser or the tip, it like, Thank you. 